Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Bracket Fantasy Sports Cards. Thanks for being with us today. Uh, we have a special rip today, the 2022 Topps Gallery Monster Box. Uh, some people will call it a mega box. The box actually says neither mega nor monster on it. Um, but it is a retail exclusive, uh, Walmart exclusive, and it's available on tops.com. Although at the time of recording, they are sold out. And I don't know if they will be replenishing. So basically Walmart or secondary market are going to be the only places to pick this up uh, in blaster form uh, or the monster box that we have here today with two autograph cards. Uh, I was honestly not certain that I wanted to open this and then I found it and I have seen some videos on YouTube where they have seen either terrible boxes or just absolute God box monsters. So hopefully we have a monster box and not just a inflated mega box today because I want to show you guys some cool stuff. So Tops Gallery, uh, pretty neat set. I like the artwork. It's very plain, but it's also very uh, player portrait centric. There's not a whole lot of action shots and uh, I kind of like that. It's, it's a good looking card. We're going to see them here pretty soon. You can see some examples here. Uh, right here, we've got the Gallery of Heroes. That is the case hit. Uh, it is one in 400 some packs, I believe. Well, we'll go ahead and pause here so we can take a look at it. All the cool stuff. Some nice inserts. Uh, the, the autograph checklist is bizarre. There's all kinds of epic autographs we can pull out of here and i have seen some and i've also seen two rookie pictures that no one's heard of so hopefully we don't get that hopefully we get some cool color short prints some of these uh green patterns blue patterns something like that because those are very cool looking cards uh so let's go ahead and take a look without any further ado 2022 tops gallery 100 total cards gonna be 20 packs five cards per pack and uh, from what I have seen, everyone kind of pulls the packs out and starts ripping, and they seem to hit the autos later. So I'm guessing they're maybe at the back of each stack. Uh, so we're just going to rip them the way that they come out and hopefully sweat the autos a little bit. All right, we'll put that back there. I've got two card stands set out for our hits. But let's get into it once I even these out. All right, we will start with the right top pack. And I know I've heard that these are a little difficult to rip, and they are. Maybe they come from the bottom better. A little bit. All right. Here we go. First pack. Jazz Chisholm. And there is our uh, base card look. <clears throat> you can see it's very, very plain. But also, I like it. I, I like the not deep field action shots. Um, I think they're, they're very cool. Jazz Chisholm. Reese Hoskins. Cedric Mullins is going to be our rainbow foil. These are one in three pack odds. Seth Beer, rookie card. And Mookie Betts. So not terrible. There are some very cool uh, short print kind of, it, it's like, I think it's the same picture, uh, but maybe a little bit artistic, like a painting version of that picture or Maybe some sort of filters run on it. Um, those are actually one in two cases. So twice as hard to hit as the case hit. Um, and they are very cool. Uh, there's not a whole lot of them. So hopefully we get, hopefully we can get one. We can take a look at it so you can uh, spot the difference. Here we got ba Brandon Woodruff. Bob Gibson. Nick Castellanos. Juan Yepes and Alex Bregman. And we are also looking for the uh, private, what is it called? Private uh, signature, private screen, private issue. Private issue one and 20, those are gonna be numbered. Um, and there should be at least one in here. So those are pretty neat. They just have kind of a gold stamp at the bottom. <clears throat> All right, Ronald Acuna Jr. Jackie Robinson. So our first insert. Not bad. This is the Modern Artists. And I believe that is not a numbered version. Nope, Jose Ramirez. Um, but these have a lot of color in them. And I think it's the foil that indicates the uh, parallel color. So this is the base. 
Modern Artists, Alex Kirilov and Greg Maddox. So we're sweating two autos. I haven't seen anyone get gypped on any autos. I've seen a couple redemptions. The redemptions were not huge players. I've also, out of one of these boxes, seen uh, Wander Franco out of 99 autograph, which was very cool. Marcus Stroman, Derek Jeter, Kristen Yelich, Ian Anderson, and Ty Cobb. Got to keep remembering to look for that stamp at the bottom. That way we'll know that's numbered because it doesn't really change the color on the card all that much. But yeah, I saw a video where somebody was struggling with the packs and uh, they are indeed tougher to rip than normal packs. All right, Randy Johnson. Ryan Mountcastle. Their first auto, JT Realmuto. So that's cool, one of the veterans, JT Real Muto, and this is going to be the base, this will not be numbered, but uh, not bad, not terrible for the Phillies, pretty cool. Shane Bieber and Mark McGuire to round out that pack. So first auto, Real Muto, not a bad looking card, Got a little bit of a soft corner on it, but not too bad, first auto down. Uh, totally wrong about the placement in the box that was towards the front but hopefully we can sweat the other one if we if we find the other one before we see it we're gonna we're gonna sweat it till the end just so you're aware Kirby Puckett on the back Manny Machado Heliot Ramos Matt Veerling rainbow foil rookie card not bad Xander Bogarts and Kirby Puckett I think we'll uh We'll probably sleeve up the Rainbow Foil Rookie. Those are always fun to have. Nice looking cards with the foil. And he will take the stand for now. So let me know in the comments if you guys are excited about Topps Gallery. If you think it's overrated. If you think it's overpriced. Which I would tend to agree with. Until if you watch a lot of videos on these. There has been some awesome stuff coming out. Which I've seen several people double triple easily the cost of the box at $80 retail Cody Bellinger Hunter Green rookie Mike Trout this is the um, Jeremy Pena and Anthony Rendon this is an insert this is the I believe it's a artist gallery portrait gallery something like that but Mike Trout very cool and uh, you can get on all of the inserts you can get those autographed as well with the sticker auto on them so pretty cool Mike Trout I like that it's a very basic design but I do like it not bad all right Trout take the stand but yeah if you guys are excited about Topps Gallery and you want to rip some I recommend these monster boxes over the blaster boxes because the two guaranteed autographs is you can't argue with that. J.D. Martinez, Matt Brash, Connor Wong, Rainbow Foil Rookie, not bad. Shane McClanahan, and Eddie Murray. Still haven't seen a short print or color or anything like that yet, but there's still plenty of packs to go. And we already have two Rainbow Foil Rookies. So we're not off to a huge start, but a couple of those... Uh, Massive boxes that I saw were just started hot and, and never let up. But hopefully we can have the first one that just kind of slowly heats up with Corey Seager, Edward Cabrera, Christian Yelich. There's our private. This one's going to be numbered to 250. Aaron Ashby and Jordan Alvarez. So Yelich, 84 out of 250 on the print. And other than that stamp, the foil, foil, same color as the base. So basically it's just that stamp and then the number stamped on the back makes it the numbered parallel. So we got that. Uh, not even quite halfway yet. Probably be a little bit easier if these packs weren't so difficult to open. Here we go. 
Giancarlo Stanton, Kyle Muller, rookie, Brandon Marsh, rookie, Ozzy Albies, and Shane Baz, rookie. So three rookies in that pack. Not too bad. And last pack of the first stack. Can't feel for fat packs or anything in here. There's no, uh, no mems or anything different. Sonny Gray, Jaron Duran. Oh, Alejo Lopez is going to be our other autograph, not a numbered one. Whit Merrifield and Duran. Look at this. We got Duran Duran. That's funny. Two Duran Duran rookies. And uh, Alejo Lopez is our autograph. Definitely, yep, not numbered. That's just the base gray. So now we're just hoping for a case hit or, uh, oh, I forgot to mention the, the art cards. They have a, what, what was that called? Hold on. That is called the, it's not portrait gallery. We got one of those. Oh, you can also get uh, one of one sketch cards. Pretty cool. Printing plates, that kind of stuff. Um, not gallery. Works of art. Works of art. So there's one that's uh, Mona Lisa. You can get the Mona Lisa rookie, which is pretty cool. And those are also very rare. I think those are one in 4,000 packs, something like that. So it would be nice to hit one of those. But so far from what I've seen with a box that's going this way, we're not going to hit anything major like that. Mariano Rivera, Casey Mize, Ronald Acuna, Master Strokes, Cabrera, not a parallel or numbered or anything, and uh, Contreras, rookie, Ronzi Contreras, so a couple of those inserts, and uh, I'm going to go through and look for all these uh, short prints. I have heard that the short print, you know how Tops is with their number, um, 715 I think is what it is. It's gonna end in 715, those are the short prints. But they should be noticeable um, photo variations. Uh, it should stand out without any other indication. We'll see, hopefully we hit one and we can see it. Roger Clemens, Andrew Vaughn, Rainbow Foil, Contreras. Austin Meadows and Matt Veerling. So hitting some rainbow foil rookies. That's pretty nice. Can't complain about that. I would like to get one of the cool colored short prints. Maybe we could hit uh, at least one like Bobby Witt, Wander Franco, Abrams, somebody like that. Chipper Jones. He's in the uh, autograph pool. Jackson Kowar. Another Master Strokes, Chipper Jones. Aaron Judge, MVP. Jake Myers, rookie. So it'd be cool to get uh, one of the short printed Aaron Judges. Aaron Judge also in, I think, two or three of the autograph sets. So you can pull an, uh, an Aaron Jones autograph. Aaron Judge autograph out of Topps Gallery. I mean, we can't now because we've already hit our two, but. Someone good. Adolis Garcia. Jose Ramirez. Tyler Gilbert. Rainbow foil rookie. Not bad. Clayton Kershaw. And Josiah Gray. Uh -huh. I hope that I haven't missed anything. If I have missed something and I haven't edited the video to show you as I'm going through it, that means that I didn't find it after the fact. And that means... That I'm counting on you guys to let me know what I missed. Reggie Jackson. Bryce Harper. There's our next wave. That's cool. It's gold foil, so I don't think that's going to be uh, numbered. Nope. But Hunter Green, Cincinnati Reds. Next wave. It's a cool insert. It's not my favorite. Um, but it's nice. Dansby Swanson and Spencer Strider. So put some of our inserts down there. Just a few packs to go. Stick with me. Stick with me. Here we go. Cal Ripken Jr. on the back. Buster Posey. 
Rodolfo Castro, rookie, Tim Anderson, Joey Bart, and Cal Ripken Jr. Correct me if I'm wrong, but wasn't this exact pic picture on a card from like the 90s of Cal Ripken Jr.? I could have sworn I had this when I was a kid. And it was like the same picture with, uh, you know, the older set. Could be wrong. Johnny Bench on the back. Rafael Devers. Lars Newtbar. There's going to be something numbered. We're going to sweat that one. Luis Robert. Johnny Bench. Uh, we'll put those down. We'll put Devers down. And Lars Newtbar is going to cover that green. Look like a green uh, pattern. Look like a green pattern. Green pattern is one in 108 packs. So that's probably, I would say, numbered to what, 150 or less would be my guess. Totally a guess. Salvador Perez. Tyler McGill. Austin Meadows, Rainbow Foil, Trevor Story, Ricky Henderson. Well, we got to get, we're down to one pack. We need a Wander or a Bobby Witt, Rodriguez, something. In the very last pack, I actually didn't spoil the back. How about that? Trey Turner, Romy Gonzalez, Otani, also in the autograph checklist. Jake Berger and Joey Vato. So we have one chance left for a green pattern Wander Franco. That would be sweet. Um, nope. <laughs> but it is Ricky Henderson, which looks pretty sweet with that green color and the number out of 99. 94 out of 99, Ricky Henderson. Very cool. Nice looking. I like that. So we didn't have one of the God boxes, but... It was a fun rip, and hopefully this will uh, help you guys decide if you want to invest in some new Topps Gallery 2022, check out some autos, have huge potential, honestly, for getting some, some massive cards, or uh, spend $80 on a Ricky Henderson Parallel. Up to you. So, guys, thank you for hanging out. Uh, we got some really fun, exciting stuff, giveaways coming up in October. Stick with us, like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll see you on the next video.